Welcome back to Booster Therapy, your cure for that pack cracking addiction. We're back again today with another quick little video and another blister pack of Battle Bond. Honestly, I really just can't get enough of this right now and we're trying to buy up what's out there as they aren't gonna really be printing this anymore and there is just so many good hits if we can get lucky enough. Also, getting a few of these blister packs because we're still working out that whole theory of the odds of getting Mythics and that whole sort is just slightly better when it comes to a blister pack. And again, a blister pack, if you don't know, is one of these pre-packaged things that come from Target or Walmart. Um, you'll get those booster packs that are kind of wrapped up in this kind of this sort of packaging. That's that's exactly what a blister pack is. So supposed to be slightly better odds. We're actually going to test out a full theory on that in a video a little bit later um, that will be coming pretty soon. So we'll see how true that is as compared to a booster box. We're going to be taking a booster box of Dominaria and comparing that to about equal value in, in money spent for blister packs to see really where where we get the better pulls, what looks better for us, and at the end of the day, which one held better value. So stay tuned for that. But for now, a quick video, just opening these six packs of Battle Bond that were in that blister pack that we just popped. So we'll see what we got here. So the first pack is a zombie token, a uh, planes, and there's the rare Sour of Temptation. Nice rare. And we'll keep peeking through the uncommons just because there are a few that have a dollar plus value. The Impetuous Protégé, Proud Mentor, and Aim High. All right, so none of those. So really what we're hoping to see is Maybe if we got really lucky, a couple mythics, or getting that foil rare, something along those lines. All right, a warrior token, a forest, and all right, a dual land from this uh, from the Battle Bond land cycle. So we got a luxury suite. It's another great hit. All right, lava fiend overlord, tenacious dead, and. Angel of Retribution. Come on, Royal True Name Nemesis. All right, we got a Zombie Giant, a Mountain, and hey, True Name Nemesis, not foil, but still a nice hit, nice mythic pull, and just Really cool original artwork from that original printing. I can't remember when tr which set had True Name Nemesis, but great card, great hit. So far, we're kind of three for three for just really solid rares, uh, rare or mythic. Got the Vampire Charm Seeker, the Long Road Home, and Out of Bounds. All right. I don't know if you guys are watching those uh, Guild Guilds of Ravnica. Spoilers, but there are some super hot cards coming out for that set so far. So something else to get excited about and other future videos that are really going to be focused on opening a couple of those boxes coming pretty much as soon as it releases in that pre-release weekend is just a few weeks away. Got a warrior token, a forest, and oh, -ho! double mythic land tax. Another fantastic hit. We are really lining up the good cards and getting them. All right, Noxious Dragon, Chain Lightning. It's one of those dollar plus uncommons, and then a Step Glider. So, man, so far, this second blister pack. The first one really wasn't all that great. It had a Seedborn Muse. This one is insane. We are getting some big time hits. And two packs to go. All right, got a Warrior Token. An island and a mind blade render. Got Oracle's Insight, Fertilid, and Flame Wave Invoker. All right. Last pack. Come on, do it. One more mythic. Let us get super lucky. Better yet, give us the twins, the two mythics in one pack. Would love to see that. All right. Zombie. 
Swamp. We get the slow build. Ah! Last one standing. All right. Let's see if we hit any of those other good uncommon. Soul Blade Corruptor, Soul Blade Renewer, and the Gold for Gold Forged Sentinel. All right. Well, hopefully you guys enjoyed that quick video. Again, we're just really looking to explore some of these blister packs and. For the second one, this is crazy. I mean, the True Name Nemesis, the Land Tax, even a few of those rares just rock solid. So really, really good value out of that pack. Um, so hopefully you guys are enjoying that. If you like what you see, please share our videos. We're trying to get our name out there. You can also click down here to view the other videos if this is your first one, or you can click over here-ish, somewhere around there, to subscribe to our channel and stay tuned for the future videos. Again, we're gonna do a really full breakdown of these blister packs versus a booster box and some more exciting things to come. So really stay tuned, share with your friends. We thank you so much for tuning in and soon enough, we will do the flip it and rip it. We have gotten a consistent request. We will fulfill that request. Don't worry, we're gonna be ripping some cards. Thanks everybody, have a great night.